I'm keeping my hands warm and we heard, I saw it happen last night. We saw this man throw hot water into the sky and it turned into snow. Now, I don't know if I've been holding it too long to try it, but uh, let's just see what happens. Okay. Let's see, I'm gonna try it. All right. See what happens here. <laughs> Woo! Wow. That it kind of happened. Yeah, that, that was crazy. pretty amazing. Hot water, this is boiling hot water and it turns into snow immediately in this kind of cold. Uh, Absolutely uh, crazy. It's like a, a cool science project. Well, it actually feels like it's getting colder here. Um, it's, it's really, it doesn't take long for the shivers to start setting in. We've been out here for maybe about five, seven minutes now, and already you can start feeling the chill come in, even though we have on so many layers. It's no joke here, Brooke. I would be happy to take one degree weather at this point. And I've decided also that polar vortex is now a curse phrase in my mind. That is just, those are bad words, but it is so brutally cold out here that the police said that they have taken their focus and they've changed it off of just looking at crime and looking for people who may be in need of getting to a shelter, who need to get to a hospital. That's the priority right now. Transportation department as well, looking to keep these streets clean. They're telling people to stay home. It is so cold here that they closed down the schools for cold, not for snow, for cold. It's still, I mean, even if you're used to it, right, Brooke? It's still cold, it's still super cold. There is a limit for humanity on how cold you can stand it. And this would test that limit for lots of children. So yes, they closed down the schools and I was sitting on a plane with a woman who actually had on sandals because she was coming back from Tahiti, but she's from here and she's lived here. And she says that this was just shocking to her. When she left, it was 30 degrees and she could bear that. It's a very different story though out here now, because while it is negative 17, negative 18, the last couple of times I checked, when you add in that wind factor, it is brutal. It's just, it, it takes your breath away. The first few times I breathed when I walked outside, I just started to cough because it was so cold. 